Oh, I did it the wrong way. Take it off. Yeah, I'll set it up. Pull that down. Nice. Yeah. Now, where am I? Where, am I? where are you, Peter? <laughs> if you'd be anywhere, you'd be in here with this group, yeah, right? You should have been in here, right? <laughs> the space. I think space around here would be good. <laughs> Hiya. Yeah. Hello. Come down to Delcon. I always think, no, I'll never get starstruck, and then I see him there, I'm like, Splash Garden. We, uh, we thanked him for saving every one of us. <laughs> what did he say? He, he laughed. I don't think it's the first time he's heard it. I was a Mongo man uh, with Melody. I was uh, a Borean. You see me just there, looking very innocent. I wasn't actually in the film, but prior to them actually making it, they had to do all these experiments and tests with the Hawkmen, who figure largely, as you know. Uh, and so I was down at Shepard and Studios for quite a few weeks, being um, fitted up into the costumes and the wings, being flown up in the air, being carved out of polystyrene. You know, you know Queen did the music for the film? In the ceremony, they actually played Pink Floyd, Crazy Diamond. They played that, mu that music and it, it created an atmosphere. So they actually used a, back, a, a musical track to set the atmosphere. Well, this is the actual stump monster from the film 35 years ago. This, this is his first public appearance since he killed me in 1979. When I was asking Quentin how he got into even writing, because he had started as an actor, he said how he would rewrite, he would take scenes from movies that he liked and do those in acting class and add to them. He would act the scene with a partner where he put your hands